Hello, my name is Mel with Flame Engineering Red Dragon Torches. Today we're going to talk about assembling our torch kits with our squeeze valve assembly, which is an accessory. Our torches are come in two colors. There's silver or gray and red. And there is a reason for that. So when you call in with any type of questions about our torch kits, you can refer to the color of the torch that you have and we'll know exactly which torch kit you're talking about. Now, your torch kit comes with a manual. That instructional manual offers on page two exactly what parts you get with the kit. Now, it also lays out how to assemble the torch kit. Now, what you get with this torch kit is you get a hose, you get a POL, and you get a squeeze valve assembly. You'll either get a capsule of thread sealant or a packet of thread sealant and also a spark lighter. Now not all our torch kits come with a spark lighter just so you're aware of that. Now if you have purchased earlier a torch kit from us without a squeeze valve then your torch kit assembly will have a needle valve in it you need to remove the needle valve that's no longer necessary when you have a squeeze valve assembly. Now what we're going to do is go ahead and assemble the squeeze valve first. Now you will need to get some pipe sealant, put it on the male threads, attach it. Now I've got some tools here to make sure you get it nice and snug. Again, some pipe sealant. Make that connection there. You can use wrenches here again, one here, and then the nut is on the back side. So that, that way you can hold it steady and get a good, nice fit. Pipe sealant, put that around the male threads. Now you're ready to attach the squeeze valve to your torch kit. Again, place for the wrench right here on the nut, on the male, male, get a nice good fit. Now you're ready to make that connection to the hose. Again, some pipe sealant around the male threads. Make your connection nice and tight. Again, you can a nut here and here and get a nice tight fit. The next step is to attach the POL. Now the POL comes with a cap on the end and the cap is merely to keep these two pieces together. Now if it does come apart, all you need to do is make sure that the threads are at the end pointing towards the O-ring end of it. Go ahead and put the cap back on. You're ready to assemble to the hose, pipe dope, pipe compound, Make your connection. Get that connected. Notice that there's a place to hold the hose with the wrench. The end of the POL is hexed, so we can also hold the wrench and make your connection nice and tight. Now you're ready to connect to the tank. Now, the tank threads on the inside are left-handed. Turn to the left to make your connection. Once you've made your connection, using a wrench, get it nice and tight, and you're ready for flaming. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to call us at 800-255-2469 or visit our website at flameengineering.com. Thank you.